Hello. Today what I want to do is I want to test these dollar store fire starters. There's 12 in here and I paid two dollars and they're supposed to last six minutes each. So what we're going to do is I'm going to take one of these out of here and I'll leave it in the plastic bag and put it back in and it has a zip lock on it. So I'm just going to take this, strip it down some, and snap that off. Now I'll put this around and put it back in the Ziploc bag. Now my plan is to search around here and get some marginal wood. It's not dripping like I said, but we'll get some wood, we'll light this up, and just see what it does for getting the tinder going. I'm not going to light a large fire out here. But, I just want to see how this starts fire. You can feel the dampness in this here. Yeah, it doesn't even snap. That snaps a little bit. And it's also low to the ground. See, that's just bending. So, it's a good test to find out how this will work on damp material. See, that's just bending. There, it finally snapped. So, very good for testing this fire starter. So I'm going to start my fire right here and I'm going to try to use a ferro rod on this and just see how well this takes a ferro rod spark. Oops, I just broke that one. So I'm just going to lay that there and I'm just going to fluff this up a little bit. It looks like it's fluffing up pretty good anyhow. It's fairly brittle, like it breaks pretty easy. So, see what we can do here. Well, we've got flame. Now I'm going to light this over that one. There we go. I'll light, put this right over top. Like that. And now we'll just set this right over top of it all. See how it works. Those are still going down there, but as you see, we're burning wood. So, <laughs> for two bucks for 12, sounds like a good idea to me. Thanks for watching. Take care, and I appreciate it. Fire safety, always first.